Back at it with another abridged episode. Episode 9 should coincide with episode 10 of SAO Official Enemy. Let's see what they got for us. Oh, this is the I hate humanity. <laughs> This is amazing. You really had no idea they were live streaming? No. Nope. Obviously, if I'd been proven to that little tidbit, I might have conducted myself in a slight... So where is this, like, a uh, reference of Kirito hating humanity come from? Because, like, last of Bridge episode, he just fucking popped off and he was like, I fucking hate humanity. I don't want to save them. Fuck them all, right? A different manner. <laughs> Oh, don't worry. Oh, so Elizabeth! No one cares about your adorable little freak out. They're all too busy being in awe that you can hold two swords at the same time. He is wielding. the chosen one, as it was foretold by the scrolls. But he actually is the chosen one. Like, he's the only one that can dual wield. <laughs> <laughs> They're just mocking him, though. So what's in the box, Pinky? You run through dumpsters for your next masterpiece? Well, funny you should ask. This box is- Wait, wait, what did you say? What did you say? You run through dumpsters. Okay, I thought that she, she she made a poop joke with the dragon poop sword there. With I saw dumpsters. I thought you were making a new dumpster or something. Spinky, you run through dumpsters for your next masterpiece. Well, funny you should ask. This box is everything I was able to salvage from my shop after your friend Asuna burnt it hey, down. Naruto, the commander wants to. Ah! I didn't say anything. I swear. <laughs> Wait for me. I know a shortcut. <laughs> Because Asuna burnt down Lizbeth's, you know, place. And she is the Grand Wizard, you know, and Tiffany is very scared of that. So, you were saying? Opening! Oh, God, I felt that coming. Okay, oh, and we're back. Here we go. Welcome, Kirito. Thank you for coming. I'm Heathcliff. Heathcliff, commander of the Knights of the Blood Oath. All as right. I'm sure you're well aware. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck is he doing here? What do you mean? It's the cat. They have their cat, right? What was their cat's name? Was it Jeffrey? They, they, um, this was the leader of the Mafia boss at one of those episodes, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, 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 the Mafia boss that our friends owed money to when we were buying the house. Sir Ruffles? Okay. Don Fluffles. Don Fluffles! Son of a bitch. How are you still alive? I saw you go over that cliff. No one could have survived that fall. Nine lives. Fall. Nine you lives. sly bastard. I would have never thought of that. Kirito's fluent in cat. I, I, I'm sorry. Could, could he actually speak cat or is yes. he just messing Yes, apparently he can. Not him, it may very well be both. You know, I still have that dagger you put in me. I've been meaning to give it back. Gentlemen, you can't fight in here. This is the war room. <laughs> Sounds like you can fight in here then. Good job. Da Was that a dad joke from Heathcliff? <laughs> Get it, war room? Because you should be able to fight in the war room, but you know, war room is only used for preparations. Anyways. Really? No one. I laughed. One. I appreciated it. Oh. I appreciated it, Heathcliff. We have important matters to discuss. Kirito, by now, all of Eingrad has seen the video. What? Of him hating on humanity that was live streamed, right? By the way, I could not be happier about defeating a floor boss. Oh, the other one, other one, the other one, the other one. And with a unique skill, no less. What did you just say? What did you just say? Hold up, hold up. If you're about defeating a floor boss practically single handedly, dual handedly! You know, we got the fucking Starburst string. <laughs> Starburst string. And with a unique skill, no less. You've got to admit, it's a pretty inspiring image. Maybe even enough to rally the other players to action. I okay. think you're just what this guild needs. No, what we all need. Wow. Kirito really wants him. Will you join the Knights of the Blood Oath? Nah. nah. Fantastic. Welcome nah. aboard. Come again. No, nah. nah. not interested. As I'm sure Fluffles can attest, Guilds and I go together about as well as puppies and fire ants. That's yes, a terrible. Oh, you, Fluffles. Very a terrible combo. Uh, what I agree to put a frigging cat on the council. Did, did you just? Uh, no, no, no. You just understood Fluffles' meow right there after questioning. Can you speak cat? Heathcliff Look, can also speak cat. Let's just right to the chase here, Kirito. What's it gonna take for you to say yes, huh? Money. Was items? that sarcasm? Asuna? I like to believe you slipped. What? It's a compliment. Wow, Commander! I didn't think this game had any magic. But it look at you doesn't. turning women into trophies. Got some misogynist alchemy going on. You know, Asuna has been like even the Kura deal duel. Oh, duel me to see who gets to keep Asuna. Even like, you know, <laughs> here right now, it's like, oh, duel me for Asuna, <laughs> or you join. It's like Hmm. Fine, fine. I can't give you Asuna, but I'm serious, Kirito. This game needs you. Okay. Name your price. Well, 
I suppose there is one thing. What do we have? What? 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 Hello, everyone. It You're gonna skip that? Okay, I guess it's gonna be a pretty funny thing later. It's gonna be a punchline. It's a beautiful sunny day here on the 75th floor in the wonderful town of Kalinia. You couldn't pick a better setting for today's match between two of the greatest competitors who ever graced the elegant art of stabbing the shit out of each other. Guys, it's time to gamble. The blood typhoon. Heads for Heathcliff, tails for Kirito, guys. Versus the dark specter of death himself, Kirito! Damn. Are, are those nicknames official? I'm, I'm not seeing anything in my notes. He made that shit up. I don't know who to give the edge to, Sammy. On one hand, you've got Heathcliff, master of the divine blade. All and right. And so impregnable. It is now, I stopped the video before you actually said it. You're not going to actually say it, though, right? Like, I know this is from like 2013, 2014. They're not gonna actually say it though, right? Wait, 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 God wait. Cliff, master of the Divine Blade, with a defense so impregnable, it has earned him the distinguished title of Cheating Axor F. I guess. Oh, Jesus! Jesus, he actually said it one more time. Impregnable, it has earned him the distinguished title of Cheating Axor F. I guess. Now, Cheating Haxor, I agree. Bro, fucking stop the time and just fucking beat Kirito, dude. The bridge is on to something, guys. English? But on the other hand, there's a sword saying Kirito. I mean, just look at him, Sammy. Yeah. He's got so many swords, I can't even keep track. He's got two. two. He's got he, two. He has two swords, Bob. <laughs> Bob is on fucking crack and he's the best hype man so far. Huh. I was expecting a crowd, but this is kind of nuts. I told you, Kirito. You've become a beacon of hope for these people. <laughs> also, I suppose it's not every day that someone is foolhardy enough to challenge SAO's top player. Heathcliff, oh, he's a top player. You remember, I'm the one who challenged you. Looks like the dementia's kicking in early, <laughs> old man. Wow. Also, no, I was not kidding about that ego. I owe her an apology, <laughs> but I'd be remiss to under. <laughs> he was awfully cool with that dementia joke. Underestimate someone with your reputation. So, if you really think you've got what it takes, then go ahead. Ooh, make my. Day. Yeah, this duel was so sick, All though. All aside, this Heathcliff guy is clearly no joke. If I'm gonna beat him, I'm gonna have to do something I haven't done in years. Strategize. Strategize my ass and pull the other sword out. Him with a flurry of attacks. Test that impregnable defense of his. See how he reacts. He'll try to push back. Don't give him any ground. Keep up the pressure. With that heavy armor and shield, you're overwhelmed with your speed advantage. You should Don't have. A moment to think. Make him panic. Him and you should have won right here. That happens, and then he's gonna stop time, and he's gonna fucking cheat. This fight is over. All right, I think this will work. Time to do this thing. Why am I on the ground? And the winner with a blistering four second. <laughs> a blistering four second knockout of Heathcliff, the cheating Hexor. <laughs> I can't say that word. <laughs> Damn. Kirito and the Abridge just completely got off screen. I mean, to be fair, the actual fight scene was shown through the black and white, you know, you know, the the the, the simulation that Kirito had in his head. But goddamn, in the Abridge, they did him so fucking dirty. Time to do this. And you're already dead. Yep, you're done. You're done. The winner with a blistering four second knockout is Hayes Clay. Four seconds. All right, folks. Four seconds. Did you just call him a noob? Wait, wait, wait. Did he just turn around and say noob? All right, folks. Uh, we understand that fight was a... Uh... He did. He said noob there. It's hard to listen. And there's no subtitles shown. But he did say noob. Listen very carefully. Well, listen very carefully. All right, folks. Uh, we understand that fight was a... Uh... Oh, the, the, the subtitles quickly showed a noob there. Yeah. But uh, if you just form an orderly line, the Knights of the Blood Oaths would like to offer you a full ref... Oh god. Bob, they're in the booth. Oh god, there's a fucking riot. Not the face! I need that for radio! You don't need a face for the radio, but even more jokes. Ah, uh, you've gotta be kidding me. I can't wear this. I look like a tool. Well, at least now you're You look like you're ready to join the clansmen. Now, the Knights of the Blood Oath, I mean, all they need is a pointy white hat, and they're very close to something else. That's the part. Eh, <sighs> point. Uh, the drip is happening. pretty cool, though. I don't want to join a guild. Well, then why would you challenge the commander of all people? His the why did he challenge the commander of all people? He said that in the anime. Wasn't he trying to just show off to Asuna? 
Right? Didn't he say something like, shit, why did I do that? Fine blade skill so OP, his health's never gone into the yellow. That's yeah, right. Against normal people. Never in the this yellow is zone. Me we're talking about. He just caught me off guard. Well, bully for you. But I wouldn't expect a rematch anytime soon. Wait, is this is 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 the riot still happening, dude, in the Coliseum? You ever notice this game is a real arson problem? Asna burnt down Lisbeth, and now the Coliseum's on fire. Hmm. Look, I know you're not crazy about guilds after your last one's unfortunate breakup, but don't yeah. worry, okay? Now I'm sure as hell not gonna die on you like that dumb bitch Sally. Sachi. <laughs> Sachi. <laughs> Doesn't matter. She's dead now. So cheer up, okay? Okay, you know what? I was memeing uh, in, in the anime when Asuna said that, holy shit, wait, how old is Kirito again? Am I older? And I made the Asuna as a groomer jokes, but like in the abridged version, it really does seem like Asuna's grooming, huh? It really feels that way, huh? I promise. Okay. It's gonna be better this time. Sure. Greetings and salutations, comrades. I hope the morrow finds thee well. I love this guy. He was great until he was a fucking idiot and he died right off the bat, dude. Sakurito, it is truly an honor to meet a warrior such as thee. Yeah, he is straight up in a roleplay. Like, this guy, if he plays in any MMO, 100% roleplay server, right? This guy was great, Damn though. Damn it, Asuna. This relationship cannot be built upon a foundation of lies. Kirito, this is Godfrey. Hello, I'm Godfrey. Told you something called a role player. Yes. Oh God. Hark! I hath been ordered by our wise King Heathcliff to lead thee in thy first training exercise. Plus one role play. Exercise? I don't need training from you. I went head to head with your boss. True. Oh, sooth. And pray tell, how has that worked out for thee? True. Kind of yeah, true. Kind of true. You. Now, come hither, young squire. Let us avant for adventure. Avant? I'm learning a lot of new words today. <laughs> this is my life now. I am in hell. Not yet. Very soon you will be, though. Oh, what the hell is yeah. this, Godfrey? I only Good know idea. two things about you. You're a role player, and now apparently you're pretty chummy with Mordor's most wanted over here. Yeah, this guy first, sucks. First impressions go, you're not exactly batting a thousand. <laughs> well, I may have stretched the truth a bit. This isn't just a training exercise. Tis also a team-building exercise. I have heard about thy petty squabble and took it upon myself to smooth things over. Petty okay. Squabble? You know he broke Yeah, he Asuna's stalked house, us, man. Right? And I do so apologize for that. My actions far outstripped my duties as the vice commander's bodyguard. I was out of line. Okay. Oh, that thing went in pretty deep. I think I can still see a scar. Now, now, Sir Kirito, thou must respect thy elders. Now, what fucking boomers. In youthful good looks, he more than maketh up for with decades of experience. <laughs> That's such a mean way of saying someone is old. What he lacks in youthful good looks, he makes more than up with decades of experience. Just like a double fucking two-piece combo. Yeah, he looks like shit, and he have decades of experience. I'm Thanks. Twenty-six. Ain't no way you're 26, dude. You look fucking 62, bro. They, they're no fucking shot you're 26. 26? Dude, 26? I'm 26. Liar! So... Even oh, Godfrey doesn't heroes. believe you. Godfrey doesn't even believe you. <laughs> now, is he actually 26 in the light novel? Like, did the light novel literally confirm that he's 26? That's crazy. Because he low-key looks older than Heathcliff sometimes. Like, really? What the fuck? So much. Hark, we have hitteth the halfway point. Methinks this is the perfect time to taketh a lunch break. But don't get it too okay. comfortable just yet. Tis here that the real adventure beginneth. I do not want it to spoil anything, but I hope ye two aren't ready for some trust Trust falls. Jeez, I wonder what's about to fall. The fucking trust right now. Don't drink that shit. Don't drink it. You'll die screaming. See? Yeah, you said it. No, 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 no. He could not just say you'll die screaming. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> That's not come on. He even said it before you drink it. Also, trust falls. You'll die screaming. Yeah, you said it. Wait, what? Yeah, you heard it. <laughs> oh, crap. Dude, this paralysis debuff, I swear to god, is the most OP fucking thing in this game. This paralysis has fucked us over and over again. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, Sakura deal! Didst thou spike it on my patients with paralysis poison? Maybe. Oh, you merry prankster. You cannot be serious. No, we've all had it, the valorous chuckle. But we've got a schedule to keep it. So if thou wouldst be so kind to hand me an antidote crystal. Not happening. And you did. Wouldst thou shut it the fuck up? Sakura. Kuranio's fucking tired of Godfrey's role plays. What thou? <laughs> what thou shut, shut it the, the fuck, fuck up? up. So, what mutiny is this? I've had to shit and listen to you for months as you run Shakespeare through a wood chipper. <laughs> Groans in fucking uh, role play. Groanets. Is that supposed to be endearing or something? Got it. Not a fan of the bard. He is gone. You and me, we are on the same page here. Immersion broken. Godfrey, god damn it, you're supposed to stick to your fucking character till the death. Buddy, okay, you so have no honor. Put the sword down. Oh, I'll put it down, all right. On you. Oh, wonderful. In you. Securito, if we just calmly talk out our differences, there's no end to what we can accomplish. Uh, Godfrey? I mean, sure, this looks bad now, but given time, I think we'll all look back at this and. <laughs> Rest in peace, role player. What do you know? He was right. I'm laughing already. You son of a bitch. Are you really gonna kill two people just because I humiliated you? Yes. Let's be real here, Quado. I can't. Quado? <laughs> Bro's getting the fucking Hachiman treatment in Snafu. Hiki, hiki, Tani. First. Uh, no. Your reckoning comes for a far greater sin. Although it is an unexpected side benefit. Laughing Coffin? I thought most of you guys were in prison these days. Yes, it is true. The mighty guild that once struck terror through the hearts of all is no more. All because of this! Hmm. Boss won't get off your back. Girlfriend won't stop nagging you. Did that fuck stick Tiffany sell you a bullshit dagger that broke almost immediately? Tiffany, are you selling some bullshit daggers? Hold up, we're getting a fucking Laughing Coffin ad in the middle. Well, despite the fact you spent half your goddamn coal on it. Have you considered murder? Oh yeah, I remember that. Still can't believe they just my <laughs> They have their oh, advertising yeah. commercials. Oh, so helpful advice. Ad campaign, PR blast. Get your faces out there. Send an email with your exact location to every player in the game. Okay, maybe uh, don't do that. Embarrass that last part's on them. You destroyed them. <laughs> they were doing just fine until you came along and filled their heads with dreams of wealth and fame. <laughs> If only I could have met them in their prime. So, in the abridged, the Laughing Coffin are all in prison and, Kur and Kuradio wants to meet them. But in the actual anime, they're not all imprisoned, right? Right? Or, 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 or is this actually lore accurate? I can't really remember when they explained a little bit more about the Laughing Coffin other than that they're a PK guild. So, it's just an abridged plotline. Okay, okay. Wait, you've never met them? I thought you said... Oh my god. You're not a member. You're He's a fanboy. Honorary member. Do you think the tattoo he has is fake then? Yo. It would be funny if they fucking made fun of his like wipe, you know, watermark fucking tattoo, man. You made them sell out. And what did it get them? An army at their door and a blade mm. through their hearts? It just, it used to be about the murder, you know? Oh, let me guess. You prefer their early work. And what of it? Mm. This is the greatest day of my life. Do you mind? I am trying to kill you! <laughs> hey, if I gotta die anyway, at least I can do is make sure you- He should start moaning in a very, you know, sus way every time he stabs him to make Kuradil even more uncomfortable. I to enjoy it. Die! Die! Come die! on, mo moan, Kirito! Oh, the flash! Asuna! Uh, Asuna? Uh, not that I'm complaining, but how did you know I was in trouble? Stalking you, but it's totally normal. How did you get here so fast? I may have been sort of tailing you since you left. Yeah. But not in a weird way. Not in a wow. weird way. I've never been so happy to be dating She just cares stalker. about you a lot. Speaking of stalkers, I'll be right back. Give them now, honey. Well, if it isn't the damsel in distress. Sorry, dear, but your boyfriend can't fight your battle <laughs> <point>. <laughs> Ugh, You bitch! 
What line? What line? Did I see what line? What did he say? Did he say something really in sus there? Hold up. Mumbling. Don't hit me, mommy. You know it makes me ho oh, Wait, wait, wait. I was too focused on the other line. Wait, 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 wait. I've never been so happy to be dating a stalker. And the Kuradil started talking behind the scenes. Wait, I wasn't paying attention. Speaking of stalkers... Don't hit me, mommy. You know it makes me hard. I'll be right back. Oh, hit him. No, honey. Hit him. Well, honey? The damsel in just called her honey. Sorry, dear, but your boyfriend can't fight your battles for you. Oh, you bitch! You know, people always think being called a bitch is so negative. Kind of is. I just think it shows how you're strong and confident and absolutely fucking terrifying. Please don't kill me. That's some mental gymnastics. Could I deal? Yeah. So calling someone a bitch is okay sometimes because you're strong and confident. You're pathetic. I'll let the commander decide how to deal with you. I don't want your stinking blood on my hands. What happened to him in the anime? Really? No. Is he just jailed? What? Wait, wait, wait. I, I, I actually forgot in the anime. Do we let Kuradio live? Because in the abridged, Asuna just kills him. Did, did Asuna kill? Kirito killed in the anime, right? And then Kirito was like felt bad, and then Asuna and Kirito has like a scene, right? But in the abridged, fucking Asuna kills him. Oh, good. I think the poison's wearing off. Thanks for the save, Asuna. I did not want the last thing I saw to be Kurdio's. Asuna oh, starts crying. Ricky, I hate you. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Asuna, what are you crying? You? Oh, god damn it. Again with this? You keep doing this to me. This is Just trauma is. Just get close to, you know, one HP as possible, and then Asuna falls for you again. Like the second time you've almost died this week. Actually, true. Stop to think about how I feel. Maybe nope. I what did, you, what did you say? Oh, I'm such a girl! Anyone ever tell you you cry like a surly drunk? She does sound yeah. drunk. Well, it's your fault I'm like this! Oh, you bitch. <laughs> Wanna get married? <sighs> ash in my yeah, mouth. Yeah, there we go. Damn, was that filling. Thanks for dinner, Austin. It was like ash in my mouth? <sighs> it was like ash in my mouth, but damn, was that filling. Asuna's cooking is fraudulent. Thanks for dinner, Asuna, but, uh... Are you sure it's okay for me to be over this late? Why wouldn't it be? Mm. Oh, sweet, naive, stupid Asuna. You may not be able to see the dubious implications, but to a man as worldly as I- Video game sex. Cue saxophone. Hi, uh, uh, Asuna? Why Sexy music. Still on? Sexy Do music. Or what? Sexy music. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> What the fuck? What? Whoa! Oh, Rosalia! Oh, I love you too. Rosalia? You thinking about Rosalia in bed? Who the fuck is Rosalia? The yeah, milf? The red, the red haired girl? Wait, wait, Asuna, no, 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 I can explain! So I guess Kirito thinks about Rosalia instead of Asuna when he's about to climax, and that's another episode of a. Wait, 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 is there a little bit more? Is there a little bit more? Wait, 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 wait! Guys, look! It's Kayaba! Oh, right! Rosalia did say you're right! Rosalia's joke, Rosalia said when Kirito cut her, he was she was like, this is the deepest you'll ever be in a woman. That okay, okay, that was actually just angry sex at the end, but okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Guys, look, it's Kaiba. Guys, it's Kaiba. It's Kaiba, guys, Kaiba is a lolly, and that's another episode. Y'all know what to do. Go give him a like. Sub to the channel. I, honestly, I don't even know what the point of this is because they're so fucking big. But hey, that's it. We'll see you on the next one with the, the fucking family episode.